so EDH steering. And what it is that we created is Sphere. Sphere is a spatial computing enterprise platform that basically covers all the enterprise use cases that you want to have nowadays in one single unified application. The use cases being remote assistance, augmented calibration, collaboration, and workflow support. And what it actually can do, or what it actually does, is it transforms industries. For example, one of our customers, Vistronic, um, they were actually able to save 52 million per year in um, reducing machine downtimes. Or, for example, Halter, one of the largest Swiss construction companies, they were able to, to save 2 to 5% on every 100 million investment on construction. And Renault, the French uh, car manufacturer, is actually transforming its entire car design process with our solution. And for that, we're going to very briefly switch to a live demo. You can see that. Let me just. Uh, yeah. Okay. Now you can see it great. So I see now, or we see what Frank, by the way, is our uh, VP of Sales and Business Development, um, sees. And what he has here uh, as a hologram here in the room is a foam model that Renault is using to basically test new parts of a new car. What we have there is a steering wheel that has been installed and Frank will now switch that in real time, um, something that would have taken them weeks because they had to manufacture that new steering wheel, they had to attach it to the actual foam model, and we can basically do that within seconds in real time. All the, the models or everything that you see here has been processed automatically from their existing CAT and, and CAD data and brought into mixed reality. As you can also see, we can basically handle arbitrary content. That's PDF. Frank is going to spawn a picture. Um, we can also handle videos and so on. And this is really how they uh, helps them to transform the design process. We could also be several people wearing one of those goggles and everyone would see the same, shared in real time, and they could really collaboratively work on that model and iterate very, very quickly uh, on, on this design process. Okay, we're back. Um, so our current traction is actually, we have some major proof concepts with companies like Renault, with companies like Airbus. Um, we have um, 15 pre-orders already for a solution from some large companies. 30 more are actually currently in testing mode, and we hope to um, convert as many as we can of them. We have established partnerships with large uh, distributors, TechDate.org in the Western world, Changhong IT in China, because we already operate in China as well. Um, we have uh, co-selling negotiations are ongoing with Microsoft and with Infor and SAP we basically have an alliance to um, bring their ERP and CRM data directly into our solution into mixed reality. Um, the hardware, we're actually waiting for the, the next generation of uh, mixed reality hardware, so the Microsoft Hollands 2, uh, Lenovo Think Reality, Magic Leap 1 is already available, but we want to have a, a common launch or a launch on all platforms at the same, very same time, um, also on the Unreal Live. Um, yeah, yeah, we can go on, but it's, it's six minutes, right? No, no, well, we were... You can, you, can, you can keep going if yeah, you want, you just have sure. okay. questions. On the Unreal Line as well. Um, and the, what we're actually doing uh, uniquely is we're really uh, focusing on spatial computing. We have a, on 3D capabilities that no one else can, and it all in one unified software product. And they go quickly switch to the very last slide. So we've already raised 1.2 million in the C round in the last November. Uh, what we're seeking now is two to three million, probably in the unpriced round, which brings us to Series A then. Um, and what we're going to do with those funds is basically growing or expanding the engineering team and scaling up the business uh, in, in Western Europe, the US, and also China. And that was it. Thank you very much for your attention. So, Eddie, you haven't explained your business model. The business model is a SaaS company, um, so it's a, a monthly licensing fee per for the application, basically.
Yes, we're, we're selling. We developed them. So everything you saw is basically our product. It's a, it's a standardized software. Just download it uh, and can start using it with your own content, obviously. But the software is already developed by us. Yes. So you don't need don't need any coders or something like that. You really just download the application and start using it. You said you have a great traction in China. Sorry. You have good traction in China. Um, I said we have a strong presence there, so we have a lot of partnerships already in place with Chong, uh, Chang Hong IT. We're also talks with uh, Alibaba, with Saik, uh, the current, all the, especially in the automotive industry, um, and we're spending quickly there also on partnerships, yes. No, no, no. The, the con that's what I said. So the content is automatically imported. So you should be able to just drag and drop your existing 3D models that you designed um, to our platform, and within three or five minutes, it will land on the on the on the goggles, and you can use it in mixed reality. You never ever have to call us. So you can bring the entire content you have within the company. We can bring to the platform very, very easily. And if you have to call in a remote expert, can you can you work off a mobile device? Yes, you can also do that. So um, uh, for remote expert, we're actually supporting um, iPads and, and Android phones, also PCs, obviously, that's what we did just here. Um, for the more immersive experience, obviously, we need uh, mixed reality glasses. So actually, we, we made uh, around 250K with mostly POCs, because we're really going to, uh, the broad launch is really starting when, when the new hardware, special computing hardware is, is released, because thanks to our friends, at Microsoft, HoloLens 1 has been sold out since uh, December 2018, um, which basically left us the last seven months without any hardware. Um, and we're really, really looking forward for the new devices uh, arriving in from September on, basically. Have you guys been using money in many Yes, no. It's, it's, uh, that's why we already have the, basically the partnerships and the pre-orders, right? That's what, we didn't, we didn't just do nothing. No, no problem. All right, if there are no further questions from the speakers, then we'll wrap up the demo portion of the night. All right, thank you.